Hey guys, I'm here at the Harpeth Hills Memory Gardens in Davidson County, um, Tennessee. And I'm coming up here to the grave of Donna Summers, the queen of disco. She's buried right there in front of a tombstone there. She was a major figure in the disco genre of music. Uh, her songs were played throughout nightclubs, uh, all throughout the mid-1970s into the early 80s. Uh, she earned a 19, uh, she earned a grant, multiple Grammy Awards in 1980. Um, so, whoops, sorry. Quite, quite famous. She was born in 1948. Her father was a butcher. Her mother was a school teacher. She loved to sing as a child. She, parents supported her. Um, and gave her all the support and whatnot. Uh, she, uh, she got some parts in some musicals. Hair, for one, which was performing in Germany. Backside. Um, she released her first solo album, Lady of the Night, which is followed by Love to Love, Love to Love You Baby, pretty sexually provocative song. Uh, her owned her two Golds records. She married a German actor, uh, Helmut Summer, and they divorced a couple years later. She changed the last name of her uh, last name to Summer uh, from her took it from her husband, but renamed kind of a. Uh, instead of a German S O M M E R, uh, we did a summer S U M M E R. Um, she had a couple of gold records, a couple of platinum records, including MacArthur Park, Last Dance, and several several others. She worked uh, she worked hard for her money. That's the only song I know. Uh, she had hits all throughout the '80s. Her final top ten hit would be "This Time I Know It's for Real" in 1989, which I think I know. Uh, her success did not come without some controversy, though. Uh, for uh, her, uh, in the 90s, she was uh, allegedly made remarks about gays and AIDS, which had a pretty negative effect on her career, especially in the 80s. I mean, uh, that cult, the, the, the gay culture was big on, you know, big on disco and big on a lot of her songs, and she uh, unfortunately spoke kind of poor about it. Uh, she also had revealed in the 80s that she had uh, long suffered with some severe depression. She died uh, 2012 uh, after a battle with lung cancer. Um, but she left her mark on the world, and uh, you know, disco would not have happened without her. She was inducted into the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame in 2013. So there you go, guys. The grave of Donna Summer. Here in the uh, Har Har Perth Harpeth. Cemetery in uh, Davidson County, uh, Tennessee.